Welcome back to Sushimi's house. I'm your loving host, Master Sushimi, joined today by my sweet sibling, Ice Ice Bobby. Hello. And we are back with some more Horizon Forbidden West. You ever feel like beatboxing? Uh, yes. I wish I could. I I know, right? I was I was doing pseudo beatboxing right before we started recording. Every time I got a chance because I felt like it. Um. Well, now I understand your mixed relationship with Pitbull. Yeah, like I said, it was like a minor psychological breakthrough because it was just like, oh, oh that's, that's not fine. super fair of me to put that on Pitbull. Yeah, that's not his, not his fault. Not he his doesn't fault. know that happened. How could he? he? How could anyone? And you know what? He would not want that. Right? He would not have wanted that. He would say now. dale. <laughs> he would. He would say no dale. <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop daleing with that girl because she's fully like way too old for you dog yeah he'd be like also like not cool that's racist ah! or like at least racist adjacent at least yeah. uh, also yeah. you're at least kind of friends with the person that she is basically cheating on for you so like cool it dude just cool it yeah be cool for like a minute uh. yeah y'all my dating history is Sincerely so embarrassing. <laughs> and not in like the I dated a magician way. Like <laughs> Like somehow I would have loved worse. To date a magician. What? I would have loved to date a magician. See, but there's no way to introduce that without people being like, oh, you have you've made some choices. Yeah, fair. I feel like I couldn't like, I couldn't you be know, like you know this why is that a full-time job. The dropout, or the dropout, the Yeah, I, I, I was re-watching Dirty Laundry last night, which I'm sure you probably heard part of. Uh, yeah. Uh, and Amy Vorpal at one point dated three, or at, throughout her life has dated, like, three magicians. <laughs> and people immediately clawed, it was so harsh, yeah. honestly, because they were, they were like, oh, Amy. Like, Amy. Like, Amy, it was her. Amy. It was her. 100% her. Ooh, okay. Gotta deactivate yeah, that. Yeah, it would be like in a, in a bag of things where it's like, who cried at Chili's? Everybody would be like, Bubby. <laughs> Everybody would know it was me. Oh, yeah, you mentioned having, like, low points mentally at some point, and it reminded me of one of my, like, real fun low points, which was just working at Subway. Uh, was so terrible, personally, and I was so stressed out that, like... There reached a point where I was just like crying every night, oh, working no. at subway, like at the subway. Uh, wow. cause yeah, dog, your boy don't move so fast. Never have, never will. I just don't want to, and my body doesn't want to. And so, they. I remember there was a. They start you off at minimum wage, you know, which mm -hmm. is seven twenty-five federally. And therefore is also our state minimum wage. Because mm -hmm. uh, they won't let them go lower. Uh, so... Word? That's wild. Can we, like, go ahead and, and, like, take care of that tall neck? That's what I'm wondering. That'd be cool. Um, go ahead and possess the tall neck. Yeah. Oh, right. So as I was saying, um, yeah, so they start you at 725 and they're like, you know, within your first like 90 days, you'll get a raise uh, of 25 cents an hour, which is nothing. <laughs> right. Um, Y'all got to think like if you work 40 hours a week and I wasn't, that's and 10 bucks before taxes. And then taxes takes part of that. Like really fight for your wages, y'all. We're gonna fight that thing, ain't we? Oh, uh, maybe that's what's going We're gonna on. fight some. We always fight something in a cauldron. Oh, yeah. Um, and so they were like, well, we, like, we can't give that to you in good court. faith until you start, like, ones. making these sandwiches so, so much faster than you are, dog. Yeah, I feel like Subway's whole thing is that they make sandwiches fast. Jimmy John's thing is that they make sandwiches fast. But, uh, Subway sure didn't want me making them slow. Um... And so that was incredibly that stressful for me. The fact that, like... What if you just find me? How do you immediately know where I am? You know that's fucked up. Yeah. That's extremely uncool. Honestly, that's dude. sexist. Honestly. I'm an empowered woman, and you knew exactly where to find me. A local library. <laughs> No, 
No, sir. No. Stay back. No. Um. Um. Oh, yeah. And also, I was, like, working late and... Yeah, one day you came home at, like, 3 a.m. or some shit like that. It was yeah, insane. Yeah. Even though... Well, because I... Subway closes at, like, what? 10? 9? Exactly. Like, I was basically their only closer. Give me that. Immediately give me that. Uh... And, like, I was in college, and I hated college so much. I was so bad at it. Uh, like, honestly, just such a terrible time. I was in a bad relationship. Uh, like, all things considered, having a bad time. Yeah. Having a real bad time. And, uh, yeah. So, oftentimes, I would be there super late. And off the clock, illegally... Uh, because they told me, like, they won't, they're like, we won't pay you if you're here past 10, so you better be done closing. Or, like, 10.30 or something like that. Ah. Uh, yeah, so y'all, if you can, if you can help it, uh, probably don't work for Subway. Uh, yeah, jeez. Here's what I will say to the company's credit. Um... A lot of subways are franchises, so mm. if some something's going down that shouldn't be going down legally, uh, it's probably not, not Subway's the fault. It's the franchisee um, and like their management, you know. Uh, yeah, so I quit within a year uh, and stopped working through college for a while. Um, and then our parents were like, hey, um, that's actually not okay. You have to work through college. And then I ended up dropping out because I didn't want to work through college. Uh, or do college, really. Yeah. That's simplifying it. There was a lot more in Yeah, it was there. more than that. But, uh, that's the Cliff Notes version. He farted on me. That is disgusting. He did a fire fart. That is absolutely filthy. No. Don't butt smack me too. Oh, I can get over here, you damn okay. pill bug. Me melee is not the way. Not with the way him. to go with this thing. Actually, what am I doing? What am I doing? Yeah, I don't know. I acid that bitch. Not you got the part you wanted. Yeah, I mean, I did acid it to begin with. Yeah, I, I know, it, but I think it was a good now. move. do the parts that like do a fuck ton of damage or the parts the arrows that do a fuck ton of damage. I don't really worry about breaking things as much. I don't I don't have any of those on hand. Oh. Um, and also the whole thing with them is like they're sniper oriented. Uh, so like you have to fully charge your shots, which can be challenging when something's moving like this. Like this, yeah. So great for starting a fight, not so great for being in the middle of like a uh, kind of wild brawl. Yeah. Like I am, you know, I give this game a lot of gaff. I do, but I am trying to learn its like yeah components yeah, like, and like gaming loops. You know. Right. Like we definitely did not realize we were doing something wrong. But, I mean, we, I mean, you, but, like, I'm sitting here. I also was like, what the fuck? But, like, we didn't know about the parts. Right, situation. like, we were complaining about not being able to get parts. And not the knowing. game was basically, like, you know, dear Mr. Policeman, we gave you all the clues. <laughs> right. But, like, hey, we said it. It was our bad. Oops, it, yeah. oops, it, oops. And I'll it. continue saying it's my bad, because I'm sure... Like, if this gets a lot of traction, there's always going to be somebody who didn't watch that part. Yeah, Which is like, you guys complain about this goatee candidate so much, and I think it's on it. Like, relax, please. And it's like, well, yeah, but, you know. <laughs> it's a video game. Oh, God. At the end of the day, this is a source of entertainment. Yeah. Both the game itself and the video you're watching. Exactly. Get help. No, just walk away. Truly, if you're not enjoying it. 
Can you just add pieces back? Yeah, it just like remade its armor, and I hate that. Hey, hey, at least it didn't gain health. That was my fear. That's true. But it would be like, oh yeah, I just like got health back. Like, no, what? Oh sweet, you took part of its thing off. Well, that's a mean red face or mean red. Oh yeah. Looks like a butterfly. Oh, it's just the cable. I see. Never mind. Ooh. You gonna be okay, Iota? That was a lengthy fight. Leap Lasher. There. Flint Hawk. Whoa. Lance Horn, which are not rideable. Long Leg. Claw Strider. There it is. Are rideable. Sky Drifter. And bellow back. Oh, these are corrupted override overrides, so I have to get more information and like finish it at the base. Snap mall. Mm. Roller back a lot also. Of info. Yeah, wow. That's thick. Uh -huh. Oh, thick. Can we seems to be a tonic? Aw, oh, we can't just use the tall neck. Seems rude. Oh, wait, yeah, we can't. Oh. No. Remember, I have the thing that highlights yeah, climbable yeah, surfaces. Yeah, I remember that orange. after you did the zoom. Yeah, so. Oh, fine. That ain't the way. Uh, okay. But I will take this. Berries. Give me some berries and cream. I mean, they're mushrooms. <laughs> berries and cream. Berries and cream. Oh. Oh, berries and cream. That fight, I think, went like. We're okay. Not perfect, One of but the better fights. Better had. than a lot of my fights have. Yeah, been. yeah. I think you were unpacking some stuff, and maybe that helped. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, getting it out. Yeah, like now, those rage now that I've learned to forgive and forget. <laughs> well, no, I will. You have to forgive or forget. You could, you know. Uh, yeah, our family's bad at both of those things. Well, <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, like. I think forgive and forget this whole thing where like you have to do it. It's like, no, you don't. You don't have to forget. You can remember it, but not dwell on it. And then you don't have to forgive depending on what happened. It is okay. Yeah, that's fair. Where's your fucking rage? Like the idea, right? The idea of like, oh, you gotta forgive your abuse. Like, no, you don't. You don't have to forgive anybody. Now, especially not if you were like straight up abused. Oh, exactly. Like, don't, you don't have to fucking forgive that in any capacity. Now, I will say, you shouldn't not forgive all the time. You gotta find a balance. It is okay. What's that? God, I don't do Facebook a whole lot. Um, I, I Honestly, I just don't like the way the format is. There. I used to do Facebook a lot when I was, you know, like a teenager. And it was like the new shit. Right, it was cool. Um, yeah, like everybody was doing it. Whatever. Um... And recently I started just like going on there and like seeing what people are post. Mostly people post like videos and I'll just yeah. like react to that. Like a meme. Yeah, or like a meme. Uh, and our cousin who we adore uh, recently posted something, a Spanish meme that was just like Freddy Krueger when he enters my dream. And it was like this very obviously like <laughs> country uh latin american guy in like a striped sweater and a hat <laughs> like kind of vaguely look like freddy krueger <laughs> he was just like hey man you gotta learn to let go of shit you can't live like this dog uh and i saw it and immediately i was like that's funny <laughs> like straight up without having any introspection whatsoever and our cousin, being who she is, like she talks with our mom a lot because our mom is almost like a almost a surrogate mother figure for her. Right. This is the her cousin mother whose actually mother passed. passed. Yeah. yeah. So um, it was just like I was surprised because I saw your son on Facebook. Number one. Which is already like a novelty in its own right. And then he reacted to a meme, and I was like, Yeah, he would like that shit because that's exactly what he is. And I was like, Can You shut up. You don't know. <laughs> Leave me alone. Hey, bitch. <laughs> I will forgive or forget that. <laughs> Sush will remember that. Exactly. It was immediately like a telltale game. Just like, Sush will remember that. But also I was like, yeah, okay. 
Okay. Like, the fact that I had that moment was enough for me to be like... Right. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm glad I heard I'm beeping, because I... gonna override you. I hope I can help it. gonna override you. I wanna override him. Oh, you're right, because I don't wanna lose Bessie. Yeah, that's really it, because you can only really override one thing. Give me that mushroom. Give me that exit. As far as, like, exploring dungeons goes, this has been, like, top tier for us in this game. Oh, you've jinxed it. I don't think so. Like, don't get me wrong. The bridge falls and breaks in half. Well, sure. I'm sorry, it breaks in half and then falls. <laughs> and then you fall. The other way around would be wild. But then they don't actually kill uh, Aloy. They're, you just have to walk around on a broken ankle. <laughs> and I bitch for half an hour about how bad game design this is because <laughs> they just make me go slow. Yeah. Um, no, it's like... Is you saying like, oh, it's all, it's all tight, it's going well, which I be fair, it is going really well. Like minus that little hiccup in the beginning where you're trying to figure out how to climb the thing, like it's gone great. But it's that yeah. concept. And of to be fair, I was doing the wrong button input for a little bit, but then I started doing the right one, and the game was like, I don't know about this one. <laughs> no, but it's like the concept of using the word quiet in healthcare, like if you, especially if oh, you're God. a nurse, yeah. especially if you work in the emergency department, or like if you're EMS, anything, you don't ever say the word. The Q word. The Q word, yeah. Yeah, so, I'm, so you know about it. Like, so, like. There's a lot of jobs that are like that. To I be mean, fair. yeah, I feel like, like everything. Obviously, healthcare, yes. But I worked in a call center. Ooh. Where. And I actually had a, a dream about this call center last night. It wasn't, like, it's interesting, so I'll, I'll spare you guys the details. There. Uh, but uh, I might not spare you the details later, bub. Uh, <laughs> oh. But, um. How high does this go? Squish. About as high as I wanted to, huh? Oh, nope. And, um, we, we had a very similar thing where it was just like, Hey man, fuck up. You don't talk about how quiet it is. Uh, cause that usually meant something was about to break back. Yeah. Um, so. And also we very much observed lunar cycles. Uh, because we, it was a complaint hotline. Like, we managed hotlines for other companies to basically be like, you got any complaints? Call these fuckers. Yeah. Um, and so, like, the wild shit would come out, like, around the full moon. That's, what, that's funny. That's or also on thing, the full moon. That's really. also a thing, in the, primarily in the emergency department, where if it gets really insane, they're like, is there a fucking full moon? The answer's always yes. It's the wildest thing. Yeah, funny enough. Yes. Oh, God. Hello. Did see you? Yeah, I know. Like, I did see this one, this one video, um, that was like, this EMS guy, like, 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 lounging in the back of the, of the, um, ambulance, and he grabs the little radio thing, and he goes, <laughs> like, something along the lines of, like, oh boy, it's sure mighty quiet, and, and then you just hear from the distance, like, did you just really fucking say that? Like, obviously trying to be an asshole. I was like, God, you fuckhead. Um, I specifically, I, I mean, I avoid it, but also especially on a week like this one that I just finished, which is like every five weeks, our cardiology team is not on call. The other one is, and it's so nice. I mean, on, normally in one day, I'm seeing anywhere between 10 to 15 consults. When we are not on call, we'll see two to five, six, maybe. There was one bad day where we saw, like, 15, and I left at 7 p.m., an hour after I was supposed to end my shift, and I was pissed. But besides that, it was a really good good and chill week. But I, I will go as far as to not say you know, not chill, not quiet. I won't even say not busy. I'll just be like, things are fine. You know, I'm having a day. They're they're good. They're good. You know, like I very like. Nope. <laughs> there was a period of time in my life where I I took to saying I'm having a day. Mm -hmm. Um, and it's such a fun expression because it means nothing and everything all at once. Yes. So like I'm having a day can sincerely translate to I'm on the verge of a mental breakdown. <laughs> Somebody keep all sharp objects away from me. Or simply, me, it's a or day. Or face my wrath. 
Uh, and you know, yeah, the opposite is also true, where you're just like, you know, sun's out. Like, yeah. that's nothing. The, the sun rolled around. It did its thing. Um, wait. Before we get too more into that, we do got it next time. That's true. Yeah. Hey. Next time at Tsushimi's house, I'm gonna open this container. <gasps> Later, y'all. Bye. You gotta know you're in for something special. You gotta feel it in your bones. Oh, you're gonna find what you need all the time. If you're looking for it, na 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 na. If you're looking for it.